so whatever. That's fine. We're what? We're rolling. We're so, rolling to whatevers. So so whenever you want to. So whenever's okay. <laughs> yeah, so whenever's. You know I, I like whenevs better. That's yeah, kind of cuter. Yeah. It's all about being cute yeah. and being hot. Yeah. And being sexy because it's summertime. And it is fucking hot. It's very hot. I'm I'm gonna be real. I know we had to lower this thing. We might have to raise. We might it have to bring point. it back up. That's okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's gonna be fine. You know. I want to say crank that. Yeah. Is that bad? Is that okay? You hear that? I think it'll be fine. We can always put a denoiser on it. It's better to not be suffering. Yeah. Yeah. Look at that. It might be hot if we're sweating though. Yeah. That might be good. It might be good. It's better than outside. Way better than outside. I'm not going to lie. Last week's episode was really fun. It was really fun. It definitely didn't inspire this outfit today. No, not at all. Just a coincidence. No, it's fine. I'm going to be changing literally in about a minute. Yeah. I'm going to put on. You just got to get the clickbait there right at the top. I just wanted to to show. Fine. You wanted the bikini there. There's the bikini. Here it is. Free pause this frame. Yeah, it's the thumbnail. That's the thumbnail. (laughs) Exactly. (laughs) There, so Max can pick a fucking good pick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Yes, welcome to That's Hot, you guys. I'm your host, Sabrina Piper, a.k.a. Funny Girl with Tits, and I'm joined by my co-host, the incredible, the fabulous, the very funny, Natalie DiCicco. Thank you very much. First... It really upsets me that I can't say Jacheco. I think you can say Jacheco. Can I really? It's not even nearly top five worst ways people have pronounced my name in my life. I just want the fucking deal, dude. Yeah. I just want it. And my dad always buys it and he claims that that's not why. He just claims that it's better. No, it's it used to be good because it used to just be Durham flour yeah. and water. And then they were throwing some they, weird shit in Now there. they changed it. Now it has riboflab. And look at your labels, people. Look at your labels. Seriously. I buy store brand because I'm broke. You could make it for cheaper. Yeah, probably. But am I going to do that? No, you're no, not. No, I'm not going to do no, that. No, <laughs> no. But that's okay. We're glowing. We're glowing. Glow- that's glowing. a polite way of saying. So fucking sunburned. and sweaty. From that stupid fucking roof last week. Dude. It looked the great. It looked great. It felt worst. bad. Oh, my God uncomfortable hot. we're going back up there in like end of september i think yeah when yeah. it's chill it would be lovely oh i went up there the other day for fourth of july yeah thinking i could see the fireworks which i couldn't because like i'm like oh right it's a shorter building right but i did find a really hot guy outside Ooh. and i let him, throw things inside. At him? I, I, yeah my pussy i was like come here <laughs> <laughs> i was like come here and he was like i'm all dirty i was like as they usually are yeah <laughs> yum um yeah he was like i was going to get bud and I didn't even tell Max the story. That's how you know. I was going to get Bud. And then I saw him. I've seen him in the mornings when um, he's going to run and I'm smoking outside like a crackhead. Mm-hmm. And um, I saw Morning him routine. In, exactly. I saw him in his undies. And I was like, ooh, he looks yum a dum dum, right? But I was like, also like, no shoes. Like, what's going on? Weird. Right? <laughs> and I was like, it's 4th of July. Definitely. And he like looked and he was like, and I was like, so you too right yeah. like hello and then when i came back he was like sitting there he looked defeated like crying like oh head in like hands type uh-huh. of thing and i was like oh my god i love this man i'm in love with this man like it's like finding a little box <sighs> with like a kitten on it was the beautiful on he the was lawn. right in the flower bed like just sitting there like outside of like the, i was like oh my god did you ask him why of he's course crying? i stopped of course i stopped and i was like are you okay? Did you get locked out? And he was like, I did. And he was like, I was an idiot at the bar. And no. I was like, oh my God. Was he still in his underwear? Yes. That's so. F- oh, yes. This was, he I made mean, a fool of himself like a at the bar. Minute. Yeah. So what happened in his is. In his underwear or he, became in, in his underwear. Well, he explained. He explained, don't worry, I'm not homeless. I said, no, I know you're not homeless. I was like, uh, I'm like a neighbor ass. I live like on the block. And he was like, oh, okay, whatever. So we start talking. And then I was like, what happened to your outfit? Yeah. Where are your shoes, dude? And he was like, yeah, I just got so fucked up at the bar. And then I was like, why do I need my shirt? And I was thinking, why do you need your shirt? And I was like, that's a fair question, right? <laughs> you know, whatever. And he was like, so I took it off. And then like, you know, I was being an asshole and I took everything off and then had my phone and my keys and it's all there. And the bouncer no, kicked me out. Yeah, dude. No. Like, oh my God. Like tragic. And I was like, well, 
you can come back to my place if you want and wait. That's and funny. I was like, you can use my phone. And he was like, really? And I was like, really? And then he was like, oh, my God. So then he calls his friend. And then he's like, this really, really nice girl just stopped. I was like, really nice. Really hot. Really. Yeah. I was like, hello. Call me the bell of the ball. I was so excited. And yeah. I thought it was a meet cute. I was just going to ask that. I was like, is this considered Ooh, a meet cute? Re- it's considered a meet cute. This is a meet cute. I thought. You know, I'm planning different things. I started getting out, if you, as you could see, different like uh-huh. items. Like I have like old like merch from yeah. concerts because I was just thinking, what would our future daughter like? What? Okay, that's so weird. My phone was off, but it did just randomly play "The Boy Is Mine" <laughs> by Ariana Grande. That's so weird. That's God. That's God. I was thinking, I was like, our future daughter would love this one day. <laughs> I have to get it out of the closet. <laughs> No. This is a, like, I was like, I was like, this guy's amazing. I just need to put myself in situations to find a sad, crying, naked man on my porch. It was beautiful. It's crazy. And I didn't do it. No. I didn't do it to him. So I was like, this rocks. Mm-hmm. This is great. Self-awareness, too, because he knew that he had, like, fucked up and everything. So I was like, ooh, I like that. I yeah. like that. And not being like, this fucking <sighs> bouncer, I, I did nothing yeah. wrong. Yeah. Yeah. And also, when I was like, you could come in and wait while your friend, you know, comes back. Right. Because he was like, dude, can you stop fucking talking to Annabelle and, like, come home? And I was like, <laughs> he has a new home. No. I'm That's like, so funny. Lay down. Lay down on me. Yeah. And I had, when I invited him in, he was like, that's really nice. But just to show, like, I'm safe, like, I'm just going to wait in here. And he, like, waited in the front. And I was Aww. like, oh, my God. Like, that's sexy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, rip these off, too. Like, right, I became yeah, all yeah, of a sudden right. the Predator. I was like, oh, no. <laughs> here, wait on my bed. <laughs> wait on my bed. Why don't you take a shower it's while you're at it? It's comfortable. Yeah, yeah. You know what? Let me scrub you. Yeah. <laughs> Top to bottom, sweetheart. Uh, <laughs> and then I thought, I thought in the end he would be like, hey, like, you want to get a drink sometime? You want to hang out sometime? Anything. Right. Took him up to my roof because I was like, well, all I want to do is see the fireworks. So let me grab a joint. We'll go upstairs. Gave him a water. Took him up. We saw no fireworks. He went near the edge. I said, please don't do that. Yeah. You're too hot. Can't lose that. Yeah. Can't lose a hottie. Oh, my God. That'd be sad. And then took him downstairs and he was like i'll just wait out thank you so much and i was like okay and i texted the friend and i was yeah. like hey just want to let you know i got him outside he's all good he's waiting for you right there and he texted me the next morning like oh thank you blah 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 and um i haven't heard anything and you know i'm hoping it's because he still doesn't have a phone perhaps you know <clears throat> but but all of me tells me um death to him death he's he jumped off somebody else's roof yep (laughs) (laughs) yep to me he didn't even make it the 10 10 down yeah he just went he stumbled down yeah and he's gone this is like i guess not misconnections because he has your phone number he has my phone number he knows where i live yeah he does know where you live he literally knows where i live he knows everything it's like, and he lives around. Do you ever see him running anymore, or it's just I been? It's seen only him been a couple a days. days. It has been a couple days. Been like three days or so. Two days. Check on Monday. Check on uh, yeah. Give it a good. Give it a good another day. Maybe tomorrow. Like maybe he's taking the weekend off because he had a bender on the Fourth of July. That sounds right. I mean, what the fuck else are you doing? I guess it's kind of crazy. It's yeah. Kind of wild. I don't know. Dating sucks. Yeah. I don't know, dude. It's weird. It's weird. And you're on like fucking Hinge and shit. I'm now I deleted, on Hinge. I deleted all my apps. I had never. I've been single for like what ten months now or something like that. Yeah. And Whoa. finally got on Hinge and then went. Oh, this is now homework I have to do. Where like I have to do dating homework. Oh, the belt committed suicide. <laughs> well, it was already killed once. Yeah. That poor snake. Um, I also went to speed dating recently, which I've talked oh, about I on a different you, show. But you so talked I'll, about on my show. Oh, you know what? We t- just talked about it in private, and I yeah. was like, "We did talk about." It. I was like, "Oh no, that was just an actual conversation." That's okay. <laughs> um, um, yeah, you went speed dating again, dude. I've only been the one time. You didn't go twice. 
No, you the first, first group, time? a bunch of them went, and I wasn't oh, with them. Go. I had plans. It's such a bummer because I had plans. Right. Invited to a birthday party of a former coworker at a different job who I kind of had a crush on, and Ooh. I was sick that weekend. So I couldn't go to that, and I couldn't have gone to speed dating anyway. Okay. It was a huge bummer. Right. And right. so then this time I went, I crushed. Just res- respectfully, I crushed. I knew you fucking did. I crushed. Dude, you're hot. You're Thank awesome. Thank you. How the fuck Thank you. Crush? There were not What's many women yeah. to choose from. Okay. Which I'm, also, I'm not. I'm not detracting from myself there. I think I'm a catch. How did they do that, by the way? What do you, the people running it? No, because if you're talking to men and women, it's just I'm not talking to the women. This was a straight mixer. Oh, okay. Okay. So okay. I was just paired up with the men. Oh, okay. And they okay. were like set. So seven about- men and like not enough women because people kept getting there late so there was so that's why the women were the worst well like i went with a bunch of people from gas and me and jorge were the first date so we just like shot the shit for a while and then he goes there's no bitches here which i wasn't paying attention to because I wasn't going to talk to them anyway. And there were two age groups. So I was like confused about like who was where. So you and Shannon in a different age group. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's it's 25 to 35 and 35 to 45. Okay. So me and Shannon each crushed in our own respective group. Yeah. But you, you guys are speed dating your colleagues. You already do that every day. Hilarious. I um didn't. Yeah. My, Mike it? and Hor. It How was like 20 it? bucks. I knew it. I knew there was a price. Yeah, it was the Jew and me. The oh, Jew tingles it was, came out. By the I was way, like, "How much you pay?" You so pay. there was twenty-five to thirty-five, thirty-five to forty-five, both at the same time. Twenty. The younger women paid twenty, and everyone else paid thirty. Woo! This so, is just like the Soho House. So I got a deal, and we got there, and I was listening, That's and someone awesome. was like, checking in, and. And the woman working was like, so you bought a woman's ticket instead of a man. Like a dude came in and was like, you bought the wrong ticket. Like he bought a ticket as if he was a young woman because it was cheaper <laughs> and just didn't pay attention. Sure. He didn't pay attention. He um, was Max. Yeah. <laughs> You're I like, I'm that. a young woman. Yeah. And um, <laughs> but it was fine. Um, That's good. Did you get a number? I got one. Ooh. I got one. And the the what happened was. This dude came up to me and I thought he was cute. Or not came up to me. He was one of the speed dates. And he goes, I have to be honest. I know who you are. And he's a gas fan. We still exchange info. So. Well, you already had your info. Yeah, but he didn't have my private Insta. So now we talk on Insta. Um, so we'll probably go out. That's it. Say la vie. Yeah. Everyone else was like not cute. Yeah. Yeah. Except for my boys, who I love very much. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. And no, no. That's it. That sucks. That sucks. We, uh, but no we'll, weirdos. We'll find a different. Uh, hey, that's great. No weirdos is great. They how were many, all very how normal. How many weirdos were everything else? So it's like a, f- mm. a bunch of weirdos in the other group who were trying to hang out with us <laughs> afterward. It's cool. But I would do it again, but not through this uh, whatever Eventbrite. Yeah. This particular one. Yeah. There's one. There's so many others. Exactly. So There's I want to so go many. to a gay one, I think. Yeah. Um, Because that was my goal going into it. I was like, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go there and I'm going to see if any of the women are bisexual. Mm-hmm. And none of them gave me bi vibes at all. So I didn't do that with any of them. But I think I would do better with women. On Hinge, it's different yeah, because there's it's all dudes. Yeah. It's kind of all dude. Like, it's not literally, but in my matches, it's probably 10 dudes and three women. That's like, that's it. I like, feel like that's actually very common. It, and that's what I mean. Like, that's that's the general experience, yeah. I think, on the dating apps. Yeah. And it's like, I'm also a woman, so I, I'm yeah. doing the same thing back to them, you right. know? But it's been fine, but I'm trying to... Cole, you're, you're not some like of a the... stupid bitch. Yeah, I appreciate that. What's your What's your hinge profile? Can we see it? You want to see it? Yeah. yeah. You want to judge it? Right now. Yeah. Oh, I'm getting a bunch of messages. I need to like stop really liking people out of like. What? Nicety? They're all right. Ew. Like I gotta stop being Why like, oh, that? I'm not attracted to no, them, you, but you like no, they, no, they no, have no, funny no. answers or whatever. Nope, I need nope. to stop doing that. Nope. You have to go. Oh, I look at it. 
do I want to have sex with you? Yes, no, yes, no, yes, right. no. Right. But then That's also that. if like, I mean, for me it's both because it's like, sure. if someone's hot but they have literally nothing, if they're like, my passion is food. So okay, give me more than that, you know, fair. like w- there's nothing that we can talk about. But you're right. Like, OK, here's here's mine. OK, I need better like answers. I think that was my hardest part. OK, most spontaneous thing I've done. Travel from California to New Jersey by train. A lot of people start the combo with that. OK, it's very autistic. Totally. Um, Love trains. Let me ask. Also, did you just like pick that? Or was that a plan? When I did that? Yeah. I had to come back from a semester in L.A. and instead of taking a flight because I like trains because I'm autistic. I That's not took spontaneous. The well, I decided you like that it. day. You pla- Fine. Fine. Not Fine. that day, it. but like the week before I went, I'm I I'm going it, by train. I yeah, I knew it. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I knew but it. no one's done that mm-hmm. ever. Fine. Fair. I'll give you that. Okay. Okay. Obviously, I know. All these things. I think my pictures are good. I think everything else sucks. Pictures are great. Figuring out my dating goals. Can I read them? Yeah, you can read that. Looking to go on some fun dates. Meet cool people. Friends, too. Liar. Recently. I made some hot friends. <laughs> of course. I need to bring up the. The friends. The is such friends. It's such bullshit because now they have like a Bumble Friends, Bumble BFF, blah, 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 blah. blah. It's just oh, yeah. everyone's just trying to fuck each other. Yuzu friends. Um, no. <laughs> Recently got out of a long relationship, so not looking for that at the moment. Hell yeah. That Honest gives me true. like a hard, easy way to reduce people is if they're looking for a long term relationship. I picture reads as you eat pussy. That's so funny. I needed one. You needed one. Because the hot pictures are playing to the men. They look great. Yes. And I needed one for the women. I needed to be like, I'm kind of gay. Oh, you can trust me. I love I love your this year. Thank you. Oh, this year I really want to write something I'm proud of and submit it to a contest or publication. Well, you put it into the Thank universe. Thank you very much. I know you're going to do that. Thank you. I can't wait to read it. Hell yeah. That's going to be awesome. Okay. You look cute there. You and a girl. I needed one to no show idea. my teeth because I like don't, That's I don't true. smile with my mouth open. I don't in any smile other with my pictures. mouth open either. And I've noticed that with my Instagram. Teeth. Do it now. We'll do it now. Look at that. That pair going. You have nice teeth speak. too. N- nice teeth too. <laughs> Shh. Thank you. Thank you. You have nice. Nice. It's so nice. That's what sound like after eating <laughs> the puppy. <laughs> Can, would you ever let a man go down on you that sound like that? No. Or a woman? What about a woman? What, well, I thought you were th- super inclusive. I thought you were super inclusive, Natalie. <laughs> That's not very nice. I'd be like, please I stop. Sound, I kind of sound retarded. I'm going to stop. <laughs> I'll blame Max for sending me the fucking <laughs> Helen Keller um festival was that you sent to me no that Helen wasn't Keller. me oh, please describe this else. oh my god i'll send it to you literally right now but um right. max sent it to me it was the helen keller festival they're celebrating where um 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 uh somewhere it's somewhere in helen kellerville it's in helen kellerville i can keep my phone keep it, yes keep it going um I'm going to find this. I'm going to find it. And I... So it's about her? Or it's just like I other people it. who are blind and deaf? It's Helen Keller Festival week and Helen Keller's birthday today. Oh. Oh. Up here, and it's crazy. Oh, I get that. Uh, In theory, there's like a niche pocket of the internet that's like Helen Keller was faking it. Like, oh yeah, that's oh. So that so when all those kids were like, Helen Keller is real. I was like, that (laughs) what do we think that she's not? But people think that she's not. That is what people think. People think that it's not real and And everything. The story's fake. Yeah, but it's also it's very Jesusy. It reminds me of reminds me of the Mean Girls, the beginning of Mean Girls, where it's like. And on the seventh day, yeah, God asked. <laughs> and I'm like, ah! Okay. Together, we could attempt to spend the day thrift shopping, but hit one store, get overwhelmed, and end up going for iced coffee after half an hour. That's the gay one. That's, That's for so the women. Gay. That's, That's so for the women. Gay. Oh, my God, Natalie. 
I like that you only like the one that I'm iffy on. You're like, oh, writing, that's cute. This other that's stuff, sweet. gay as hell. And it I'm is. like, that one looks like I'm, I don't know, not NPC, but you know what I mean. And this then I had to have one funny one. This is funny. And this then that's great. in Jamaica. That's amazing. I'm glad you did it before they get demolished. <laughs> yeah. I think your trip, I was about to say, I think your class trip is going My somewhere class else. Trip. <laughs> your class trip is going somewhere else. Yeah. Um, I said that the other day where I meant everyone at, I meant to say everyone at work, but I said everyone at school. Well. And I went, that came from deep <laughs> back here, you know? Oh, Yeah. Oh, so, my yeah. God. And let me tell you, these three, you reach out to them, no answer. I mean, the, yeah, these are from today. Um, A bad omen. The only girl I've ever... I've only hooked up with one girl in my life, and that was her name. Ooh. This girl, I hope, gets back to me. Because I... So I got the app mid-June, matched with some people, freaked out, closed it didn't open it for two weeks and this that girl i was thinking of where she was she replied to the writing one she goes oh that's so cool what kind of stuff do you write about see the good one yeah and then i replied and i asked her something about herself and didn't hear back for two weeks and i was like ah damn too bad whatever and then she got back to me yesterday Ooh. so that i'm hoping for the oh, other nice. yes yeah, the other awesome. dude who at first i was like so he asked me about the train thing. He goes, what music did you listen to on the train or something like that? And I, <laughs> yes, very much. So I like replied after a bunch of them. I went, I'm going to answer these a couple days ago. I go, I'm going to finally answer these. And I felt, thought it would be weird to go, hey, sorry, I closed the app, but now I'm back to all of them. So I just replied to his as if nothing had happened. And he like sent that? me a voice memo being like, Cool, two week response time. Love that. Ooh, exactly what I'm looking for. One, let me send one back. And oh. I go, got my ass, which is a thing that I say. I go, okay. got my ass, laughing face. Uh -huh. And then he was like, Yeah, I'm sorry. I was just fucking with you. Like, tell me about that other thing. And now we've been talking about that. I was like, I was about to be like, fuck you, but I was like, All right, let's see what your fucking deal is. You know? Mm. I don't think, think he has a small cock. Probably. Really small. So small. Let me see this guy. No. I Why? No, I'm not showing him yet. I know exactly which one it is then. Why? Find him. Spot him. I, I know exactly which one it is. I know exactly which one it is. I, I already, when I gave a glance, I already know from this behavior, this behavior, I already know Watch it's this bay. guy. It's Josh. Nope. Oh, Josh wrote howdy though. So Josh gets to go. Yeah. have The ones that I read and then didn't reply to. Uh, where is it? I feel the, naked. I feel like I should put a dress it's on. It's this guy. Second? Second one, yeah. At least he didn't ask what kind of train it was. I have a lot of men asking me about the train. I'm sure and you do, And I have do, a lot Natalie. of women asking me about thrift shopping. I'm sure. I know what it I'm doing. Just, hey, the thrift shopping was good. It's just a little wordy. Yeah. That's the comic in me. It's a little wordy. Okay, the answer it was succinct. a little long. It was a little long. It's like. But I have nothing else. I don't have a poll. By the way, I never read the polls. If you if you put up a poll on Hinge, I'm skimming it. A poll? There's polls? For what? Yeah. Polls. So it'll be like. I'm not on it. Which. It'll be like, what do you think a. What should we do instead of coffee for a first date? And it'll have three options and you would like the one that you have. If anyone has that, I'm not reading it. It's too wordy. I like think that's a said. waste of time too. Just say what you like. Say what you like or don't, don't say what you don't like. I, I don't know. I yeah. think that's insane. Yeah. That's I don't wild. like those. And I also don't have any voice recordings, I which I also memos. don't listen to. I hate that. I hate and those. Those or freak video. me out. Those freak me out. Oh, I hate that too. I also... I don't know. People are very my my voice is very polarizing, whereas people are uh, really like, same. Fair enough. Yeah. I I feel like people obviously the comics that I work with are like fucking Muppet voice over here, Kermit the Frog, and but oh, then I never noticed that Mike Figs does that. He's always like, oh, he it's not. I'm a uh, gay. 
And um, dude, you just took my retard out. Thank you. And, and you took it for yourself. I have also, when I used to work on New York Film Academy, the acting students would be like, oh my God, I love your voice. It's so unique. Like It is. It's so, so I've gotten unique. compliments on it, but then everyone at work is like, who's Miss fucking Gonzo over here? That's okay. I, I go in and out of, uh, who is it? Vocal Fry. And yeah. uh, what's the other thing? Annoying Jew. And I'm like, you guys, it's just the Xanax or something. It's one or the other. I had to get off all the apps, though, because I was getting a bunch of messages um, like uh, my favorite one was this. This was like um, I matched with you, not because I think you're hot. I just want to know how about Louis J. Gomez. Ew. Yeah. And I was like, oh, fun. Simp. This Gay. Is fun. Gay. <laughs> you're, if you've said that to a woman on a dating app, you know how many messages gay. I've gotten about Louis on my fucking apps i was like i can't do this it's I'm not crazy doing this. how gay comedy fans are it's <laughs> it's, crazy. It's, uh, it's it's funny but i'm also like yo i'm trying to get dick right now excuse you yeah excuse me also i'm like how could you match with me and ask me about another dude it's gay i That's was like a gay no man. i don't like that i don't that like that would be that. like a hard unmatch for that's me. actually when i deleted the apps <laughs> It, it was when I, I was like, yeah, I'm not doing this it anymore. It pushed you off the edge. I, I like sent a screenshot and I was like, I was like, your fault. I can't do the apps. <laughs> this that's is crazy. So, funny. so now my friend Stephanie, she's on Raya. Okay. And that's the only one I was like, I'm waitlisted on Raya. Okay. Shannon too. I feel like I've talked to Shannon about this. Waitlisted on Raya for yeah. absolutely no reason. Right. No reason. They're rude. They're rude. Guess they hate women. Guess they hate <sighs> attractive night. Except Steph. Uh oh, I'm being whatever. We love women. Go three percent of women that watch this. Yeah, and um, and I was like, if you're a three, if you're a woman that watches this, you should leave a comment. I'll like it. Yeah, I'll like it too. Also, like, wow, eleven hundred. We're past eleven hundred. Wow, amazing. We so, did that. Wow, wow. So I know. So some of you have got to be women. You got to even be. if you're gay and you're watching it for the same reasons everybody 100%, else is. One hundred percent. Um, but um. Oh, fuck. What was it? it was going through thing. Raya? Going through Raya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Raya. Stephanie has it. Mm-hmm. So I go on her Raya mm-hmm. and I'll look at her guys and anyone I see that I'm like, okay, they're hot. I would match with them. And it's so perfect because her and I have the exact opposite types. I just get their so Instagram. So you're not competing. Exactly. That's brilliant. I just get their Instagram, go to Instagram and boop, 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 follow. Because guess what? Have you got any followers by I don't know. I started this morning. Okay. <laughs> I literally started this last this night. This is a I great it last night, and then I'm doing it this, uh, this morning. Oh yeah. Saw so Eric Andre last on it last night. Weird. Yeah, that was really weird. Follow him. <laughs> Be like, hi, I found you on Raya. <laughs> hey. And you get lost. I, listen, in I get like I get so many messages, so many message requests on Instagram, all like, um, hey, we matched on J Swipe, or we matched on this. I tell you this all the time. I haven't been on J Swipe in probably like seven years or whatever. That's they use so my fo- they use my photos because I know the CEO, or whatever. They they're always doing promos for these things. I think also like if they're using send your out- photos, they should be get you should be getting a kickback. Yeah, but you know, J Swipe. <laughs> <laughs> they're not doing it. Um and I, I was like, it's just wild because I think these apps they send out like people that are like, oh, potential matches in your area. It's like, yeah. dude, I'm never, I'm never gonna match with you. No, never match. It's like, hey, I think we could have matched. Well, I went to send you a thing, but you didn't see it. It's like, no, I saw it. I saw it. I, I did also, that on purpose. Yeah, it's like I also saw your fucking nose from seven blocks away. I'm okay. I saw your moves. Thank you. Yeah, that's fine. I saw that you seven children and you're single. Sorry. So funny. It it is very ballsy. Although I think a friend of mine did that once and he was successful. I don't know. I don't not like they're on dating, Instagram. but that like she I know replied. Couple, I know a couple dudes who have done that to girls, comics, and, and they're embarrassing and they're gross. And I'm like, well, what's going on? And yeah, like, no, it works. She did actually match with somebody we know, which I'll tell you later. And I was Please. like, oh, you should totally do it. Yeah, we Sweet. like this person. We like this person. We like we do like this person. And I was like, you should do it. Cute. You I can't wait it. to hear. I, I know, hope so. I know. Uh, I've been, I've been not pushing it, but I'm like. Incentivizing it. Well, I, I love mixing worlds. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Because then I'm like, you know, can be a whole thing. Yeah, I agree. 
You pick up what I'm putting down. Yes. Always. By the way, my friend asks if that uh, potentially bisexual man is is interested in having a threesome with them. Do you remember that? You're like, oh, I have a guy that I'm thinking oh, of. Oh, my God. Wait. Is that? Uh, was that his name? Also, you whispered it into the microphone, so maybe take a note <laughs> of that. I don't remember his name, but the one dude that you mentioned. The guy who tried to fuck us? No. <laughs> who, then? You were like, oh, I'm thinking of a guy, and he, he might have a girlfriend, but oh! she might be down. Oh, I know who you're talking Okay, I know who you're talking about now. He is still dating her. Got it. I just spoke to them the other day. They are very much together. Copy that. Yes. She's having a birthday party, though, if you want to come with me. Oh. She's really nice. Maybe I should. Yeah, when is it? It doesn't matter. We don't have to do like this Tuesday. on the air. I think it's Tuesday. Cool. Come to- yeah, fuck it. Why? Maybe. Why not? You're welcome. You're welcome. You're hearing our plans. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's Tuesday night. Come with me. Sure. Yeah. Uh, I work Tuesday nights. We'll see. Oh, okay. Whatever. We'll it's see. whatever. Whatever. Who gives a shit? Fuck these people. They're not going to fuck your friend. No. <laughs> 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 hey, Max. Yeah? I'm going to pimp you out. Okay? okay. All right. First, call me daddy. Sec. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, try it. Daddy. <laughs> Daddy, sorry. All Daddy, Dad. sorry. All I need is a ride. That's what I've been asking for years. <laughs> <laughs> All I need is like a rhinestone belt. <laughs> that thing is scarred into my memory. Sure. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, dude. I don't know. I might I might get my Raya match from Insta. Riot Raya. Raya Raya IG. I like it. Hey, if they're not going to approve me or whatever, they're going to wait list me. I should tell Shannon my method. This yeah. is good. Yeah. She's never going to do that. No, it's a lot of effort. It's effort. It's effort. She wants a dude to, she wants someone on Raya to do that to her. For sure. I, I also, like, I saw the guys. I just don't think, like, they're like, uh, a I lot of French type. painters, a lot of French film guys, a lot of French. I love it. I Our love it. type. Yeah. 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 Nah, they look time. like they look like you know you don't know which way they're swinging. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But they're swinging inside of you, and yeah. that's what matters. Yep. And that's not her type. No. I don't think she would like this app. No, not at all. I think it would be weird. My roommate started just started dating a dude who is extremely tall, and I was telling really? Shannon about him. Not not that I want her to fuck him, obviously, but oh. it's funny because my roommate's like five feet tall, and this dude is like six four. Oh and God. it's just funny to see them next to each other. Max, are you jealous? Uh, uh. There are lots of five foot tall women. I love that. Like, as somebody who's like five one, five two, like I'm like I love a dude who's. I mean, it's not hard, but I'm like, Meep. yeah, I love that. I don't know. I love a short king too. Really? Yeah. Well, it depends. I'm depends. I feel like I have a lot of masculine energy in date in a dating situation. That's so funny because I feel like that too, but then people tell me no. I see it. I see that you have both. I see that you. I feel like you can lean both. You can you pick me. your shots. You know. You got me. Whereas I'm like, I feel like you're very. You put it. I'm out like, there. I'll drive. <laughs> I'll yeah. pick you up. <laughs> like that's my vibe. It's so I don't very, care if I have a short king. You're in charge. Yeah. You're in charge. It doesn't matter. No, I, I like them either like, you know, tall, skinny and dying. Tall, skinny and dying. What's the That's quote yummy. from? Uh, yeah. I like men that are kind of pale and look like they're dying. Pale and kind of look like they're dying. I call Richard. Exactly. Yes. Uh, That's the vibe. That's the vibe. And it's yummy and it's good and it's fun. Max, can you get me a spoon so I can squish this peach? <laughs> yeah. So just so you guys know, can the title be squish? We don't. We don't. <laughs> we don't serve this at Joey Rose's. <laughs> but uh, one, one a day. Never get in front of the camera again. <laughs> okay. First of all, you're next to the spoons. You're next to a buffet spoon. table. Let me teach you something. You piece of garbage from Philly. Open that. That is called a buffet table, and Watch it's about your... to go down. Look at look at the light. Pay attention, Max. Pay attention to the camera. It's coming down. The light. light is going to go down in front of the camera. You move the cord a little bit. You raise it a little so you there can you grab go. a spoon. Yeah, perfect. This is Where's insane. The this there is you insane. Go. There you go. Yeah, there, there they you are. go. There they are. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my go. God. And now you, you didn't even close the buffet table. Something's up. Something's up. I used to say, Crawl I, said, under. I said, you're not, you're not <laughs> you it. Go. That's what I thought. I said, you're not autistic. You're just a dick. Okay. And then you ran with it and you made it a bit. I said, fine, fine. Take the bit. But now... 
I do think you're a little retarded. <laughs> I don't know what happened. I don't know where it came from. I don't know if your collar was too tight at the collaring or what's going on. But all you needed to do was go right there. Trash bag. I thought the spoons would be in the kitchen. You, okay. Well, you know what? <laughs> Little do you know, oh. that's called a bar. That's a bar. That's a buffet table that turns into a bar. Now yeah. it's peachy. Now it's peachy. Yeah. And now, see, we that's made what I want to do. Makeshift Bellini. Is here. It's it's a makeshift Bellini. I was gonna make a little puree, but it's not like you know we're um we're princesses. We're more <laughs> we're more um countess esque. Sure. You know, I've just been watching a lot of. Yours is harder than mine. I'm just going to eat mine. I'm, I'm just squishing gonna it. Sh- sh- slurp it out. Well, it's going to be like filled with alcohol, which is going to run. Yeah, can't wait. That's going to be exciting. That always fucks you up bad. Oh, if you're does. at a party with some sort of infused fruit. Oh, I did that the, other, it hits I did you that hard the other day. I, I did that at the bar. Really? I fucking infused the fucking um, watermelon with vodka. Mm-hmm. And it That'll rocked. That'll you fucked up. It rocked. Have you seen the thing where you like put a like put a hole in a watermelon and you just fill it? Fill it with... Yes, I have. I've never done that, but I've, I've never seen done it. that either. Never I made homemade that. margaritas on the fourth. Did and you they really? Crushed. They were great. That's wonderful. I'm like, what'd you do? A faux bartender now. I'm just kidding. I I'm a faux that. mixologist now. No, I love that. That's what you are. I. It's just stuff that I had. It's just lime juice, but I used real limes. I squeezed the mm. limes. Hot it was very good. And my friend very gave Bethany me this Frankel like of you. slush. It didn't work. It was foolish. Like a cup mean? that you leave in the freezer and you take it out. I'm okay. And then you pour your drink into it and you squeeze it a bunch oh, and it that's slushes so it. Fucking cool. And I was like, I'll do that with a margarita. Okay. But A, margaritas have ice in them. So if you do that to it, it's just going to be strong as fuck. Like it's going to taste like a punch in the nose. Oh, interesting. And it wouldn't freeze because it's all alcohol. It's all alcohol. <laughs> you learn. But frozen margaritas. Not my proudest moment. But frozen margaritas. Ice. You blend it into the ice. Oh, that that makes a lot of sense. As a bartender, that was embarrassing. I mean, you can say mixologist. you can say what I said earlier uh, that was embarrassing, where I was like, oh, I made Campari spritzes the other day. She's like, oh, cool. I've never done that. I'm like, yeah, it's like an Aperol spritz but with Campari. <laughs> And she's like, yeah, I'm not retarded. It's like, yeah, I, I got that. Put that together. I got that. And I was like, I didn't ask like how to build it or what to do. Yeah. I was just like, yeah, I just never, never done that. That's cool. So I made two this. I made the Campari spritzes and I made margaritas. And they were Ooh, great. OK, that's why. Because I was like, I didn't remember the Mark. Part. Yeah. Marks were Fourth of July. My roommate and her new boo made steak tacos and they were killer. And oh, got their steak tacos. They need to make a porno. Five feet, six, five. Hello. I'd watch it. And they're always fucking. I'm just kidding. No, you're not. But it's true. You hear it, don't you? I just, sh- I don't hear it. Thank God. I don't hear it. We have thick walls. Oh, yeah, you're in Because there have been times since we've lived there that I've been like, you hear anything? And she was like, no, you hear anything? And I was like, no. And then we would high five about it. <laughs> I'm like, sweet, thick ass walls. Fantastic. Um, there was a fire at the deli the other really? day where I live. I don't live in the deli. I'm not a rat. I'm not a bodega no. cat. But not to you. To Above. Them. I live over a deli. There was a fire. Ooh. The fire alarm went off. I went down the stairs and the neighbor came out too. And we were all like clustered downstairs. It's like a family with like a dad and a mom and like a oh, teenager and a baby oh. and a dog. And they all come oh. down and the alarm's going off and we thought it was a false alarm, but there's like smoke yeah. in the in the deli and the bunch of trucks came and the the owner who's my landlord has three sons who are all from like 16 to 35 or something yeah, like that yeah, yeah. and they all come in in one car and they oh just God. pile out and it turned out to be like a fucking fridge coil burning or something like that like it was not a fire it was just like oh, something like God, singeing dude. But there were four trucks, and then we were just sitting outside waiting for them to tell us that we could go back. Like, they had that's, to find it yeah, before they could let well, us back Well, that's scary, in. but thank God you guys are all safe and yeah. everything. A little annoying. I was like, what do I do with my cat? Because my cat's upstairs. I was like, oh, what yeah. would I do with my cat in that situation? Because she hates the carrier, and I don't know what I would do with her. Where I would have to, like... What floor? Oh, no, second. I'm not going to say... Okay. There's only, it doesn't matter. There's, yeah. only, there's only apartments in one place. Uh, sure. Um, you also said you live above it. Um, 
Toss it. Clutch. Toss it. Clutch it. And then see if one of the neighbors would let me leave her in their house or something, I guess. If the thing was burning? Their place is burning too, the neighbors. Well, like up the street. Go to like. Oh, like up the street. Yeah, go somewhere no, you else. hold on to them. Yeah. Well, she would run. I'm afraid she would run. Get a leash. Get a cat leash. <laughs> get a cat leash before. Yes. Get a cat leash now. No, for get a cat future. leash now. Yeah. Be prepared. It's all about being preparado. True. Like um, those those people who prep for Doomsday. Mm-hmm. Where are they now? Dead. And Probably. The, dead. They, they still think 2020 is happening. Yeah. They, they still think Anthony Fauci is doing something. Oh, oh. I meant, I thought you were going to say 2012. Yeah, oh, I was no. saying 2012. <laughs> yeah. Another good one. Well, you know the day that, like, the world was supposed to end in 2012? Mm-hmm. That's the day I lost my virginity. Mm. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, isn't that funny? That is Can you really give us funny. a brief you know synopsis that day of that, that story? The world was going to end in 2012? That was the day my dad died. Really? Really. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. Look at that. Whoa. Yeah. So if Max knocked somebody up, it would have reincarnated wow. as my dad. Wow. <laughs> Your dad would have been a quarter Asian. Sick. <laughs> it's what he really wanted as Hot. a Jewish man. Yeah. Oh my God. Nothing is that, fun was that really? To me in wow, that's so funny. Yeah. Me neither. <laughs> no, true. Nothing memorable either. Oh, wait. I lost my virginity in 2012. September. I lost mine in 2013. No. 15? Yeah. I think. Oh, wow. Yeah. Late bloomer. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, you're younger, though. Oh, yeah, that's true. You guys are older. Yeah. Yeah. But I was still, like, 17. So, so, yeah, I was 16. Yeah. Yeah, that's not late 18. bloomer. Yeah, no, you're the late bloomer here. You're the <laughs> yeah. disgusting old. fucking old, disgusting <laughs> piece of shit. I have to put my dress on. I feel half naked. But yeah. Keep, keep talking. Okay. Um. Mine was very boring. It was, like, with my ex. When was it? I'm using the lab. 2017. <laughs> no, not 2017. I was 17. So it was like 2014, 15, 14, 15. And did it was your just, dad also die? No, just no my dad <laughs> did not also die. Did you did you lose your fraternity before or after that? I lost it before. Before. Okay. Um, it was on the floor of my attic, which is like a was like a hang room. For some reason, not on the futon. On the floor. That's your phone. Oh, I know. Okay, now I have to find it. You lost it on a futon? No, on the floor. On the floor? Yeah, I don't know why we were on the floor. Mine so was like, in a car. Boo. Oh. Not boo, because that's a really common experience, that I'm is. sure. I've just never had sex in a car. I was or dr- a we were both really? pretty... Let's change that. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> we were both pretty drunk, and then I drove her home, which was also probably not <laughs> oh good. Oh, my God. <laughs> Classy as fuck. Nice. Very nice. Yeah. Mine was at my uh, ex's at the time in his place. And his mom brought us condoms and donuts because she thought like she was Regina George's mom or something. Mm. A stupid Ruski bitch. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, my friend Rachel came to pick me up and I cried and she was like, you didn't. And I was like, I didn't. And she was like, no. I remember. And then I- two months later, my dad died. Damn. So he did it. He Omen. Did it. No, he did it. I remember mm. having like a sleepover with my friends. I mentioned my roommate a lot. She's my best friend. So that's why I hang out with my roommate so much we were friends before um when she lost her virginity the rest of us were at a sleepover and she was late because she was fucking which is a funny story i love that it's a great story i love that Good the dude her. who is this tall that was a dude that was her height she fucked max <laughs> <laughs> damn that's what year was this was it 2012 was it maybe December, were you like ha- it was on the day 2012 was there like a party? Yeah, we had a party. We, we also had party. a party. Really? Mine wasn't party-esque. Yeah. Um, it was formal, perhaps. No. Mm. No shiva, no anything. Wow. My mom was really a morning. Ah. Uh, well, three days later, my dad, my, because three days after my dad, my grandfather passed. Wow. Yeah. That's tough. Yeah. And I wasn't home. I was in California. I was, at, I was doing a trip and doing stuff. And then, yeah, I flew home and they had to wait to tell me. Damn. So she couldn't tell anyone about it because they were gonna tell you. So they were because yeah, of she was afraid. Also, spilling. it was like when, yeah, and she was afraid about it going like online and me reading online yeah. and me seeing something by someone or getting an email or getting a text or like getting a call. So she so it was like two days and she had to hide it. 
um, from everyone except like the immediate yeah. people. That's crazy. no, nobody knew. No, nobody knew. Wow. Not even the immediate people. Wow, that's crazy. Yeah. That, so a similar thing happened where my grandpa de- died on my mom's side in like 2018 or 19 or something like that. And I had just gotten to work. It was at New York Film Academy. And so I just like started my shift. And I got a text from my uncle on my other side being like, hey, I'm sorry about your grandfather. And I went, I don't have the room for that up here right now. So I just like went about my shift. Yeah. And then on my lunch, I like called my mom or my mom was like, text, call me. Yeah. Whatever. And then that uncle has also died since. Where I had like a similar thing with him where my... I had like a late shift at New York Film Academy again. I got home at like one in the morning and my mom was like waiting to okay. tell me so that she like so you don't yeah. So I don't see in the morning. Yeah. You know? For sure. Yeah. It's tough. It's really tough. Um, I think just in general. I, I guess this is interesting. It it does tie around with like grief and everything, like yeah. in general. But um you're like, I know, I want more. I gotta drive. I know you gotta drive. Um I just think that, like, we we do live in a world where it's, like, you know, you have to protect privacy. Yeah. Otherwise, it's fucked. Yeah. And it's, like, it's jarring. And then, you know, things that are not supposed to happen, happen. Yeah. Like Max losing his virginity. (laughs) Like, that should have never happened. Ew. (laughs) Like, that's disgusting. (laughs) Like, I I, I think that there's cause and effect. I'm like, clearly, there was the cause and, and unfortunately, the effect. Yeah. That's gross. It's very upsetting. It's very upsetting. And now he has this, like, aura about him. Like, I lost my virginity. I can get pussy. 10 years ago or 12 years ago or whatever. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, Yeah, 12. Well, that's his mental age. So it's (laughs) hard. It is. It's tough. And that's grief. Yeah. And that's grief. That's grief. Good grief. I can't believe you get (laughs) pussy. (laughs) Yeah, it's neat. (laughs) Neat. Pretty neat. It is. It is. It is. It's really fun. I'm drinking this solo now. I'll have some. Uh, Yeah, now you'll have some. Tip it. Grab a thing. You can use mine. If you grab the Tiffany glass. I'll just use Natalie's. That's fine. Okay. We're in a cool. Right. We're in a cool. Fine. We're in a cool cool. I also have no idea what you mean by Tiffany glass. It's okay. that one. No, it's the middle one. Yes, thank yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. Thank you for, yeah, Philly, Philly, give it up, give it up. I'm more Sorry. going by it was the only glass there. Yeah. Oh, the other I shattered. Did I tell you that? No. Yeah, yeah. I shattered the Tiffany crystals because uh, was, uh, I I was doing some cleaning, whatever, and then I opened a cabinet and something just came no. down. No. But I saved them because okay. the bases were saved. Excuse me, just the flute tops themselves. If you guys like watch the podcast, you've probably seen it. If not, subscribe on YouTube because you're watching right now and like it. But they got cut off. And my friend um, Ben, he like he made my little pipe and everything oh, for my yeah. birthday. I think he met on my birthday. He does the sandwiches with Joey. So yeah. um, he like makes like pipes and really beautiful bongs and everything. Guys, check him out. MTP glass like he, he rocks. So he's going to take my pieces cool. and try to see if he can turn it into a bomb. Very cool. Or like Extremely a piece from neat. me. So yeah, I'm gonna I told him I was like, I'll pay you whatever. Just I was like, That's I salvage this. I was like, try to I was like, if you if you blow it up or something happens, because he has all the tools and everything, right. I was like, if it fucks up, whatever, I'll still pay you for your time, whatever. Just give me something like really cool, like a piece, like my first piece for the apartment. Yeah. Like, just like I signed the lease in February and I still didn't get a bong, which is crazy. Yeah. So I was like, I gotta, I gotta ask. I gotta ask Matt. Yeah. So that's what, yeah. So, so classless. That's what it is. Okay. What happened to your hand? Oh, I sliced it at work the other day by accident. It's crazy that we've been sitting here for how long and I just noticed that. I've been trying to hide it a little bit. And I was thinking, damn, I should have like either wrapped it or tied the bandaid or thrown it or done something. But I'm like, "Ah, I can't. It happened yesterday. Yeah, I don't mm. know. I was doing something. I'm moving and grooving. Yeah. I'm moving and grooving. But sometimes I forget what I'm doing because I'm cruising. Max, this is me pointing. So cool. bad at this. <laughs> Wrong ones. Well, we need to advertise sometimes both, right? Sometimes I'm cruising through life. And sometimes when I'm cruising, I want to beat the shit out of Max. I, wa- I want to beat him to a pulp. I want to say, 
my dad didn't die for you to lose your virginity for this. It does say cruise on it. I get the connection. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then you retire in Florida Mm -hmm. and you go down and you hop on one of these guys because you're not retiring yet. You're just cruising. Yeah. Cruising and choosing. With Cheech and Chong Cruise Chews and Space Chews. Cruise Chews. Only one milligram THC, one milligram CBD, and a whole lot of fucking fun. The Space Chews, Natalie is intrigued by. 10, Ten milligrams. milligrams, dude. 10 milligrams THC. Legal in all 50 states. Legal wow. in all 50 states. How you can order it. That? Order it anywhere online because Crazy. Cheech and Chong, they're the best, dude. I even got their album. So this, nice. I love, that's my one thing. I love like finding like albums. Obviously I have a bunch. I love yeah. digging in little, like little um, bins, bins and stuff. It's the best. I find, like, oh yeah. I love the crates. I find like Jane Fonda workout. Love that. Like, vinyl. I love old workout vinyls and stuff like that. But I found Cheech and I was like, you know what? Hey, if I can go and I can spend one ninety nine, I yeah. can do it. Plus tax. How fun. I figure, you know, it's fine. Everyone likes, but loves a discount. Yeah. You know, you love a discount. I love a discount. You're like basically Italian. Mm-hmm. You know, I'm Jewish. We love a discount. So that's why when you go to Cheech and Chong and you put Sabrina 15, you get 15% off your order. No matter what deal. you get. No matter what you get. Nice. And you can send it anywhere in the States. Wow. You have someone dying of cancer. They'll probably in like Arkansas. These. Send it. It's a good gift. You have somebody who's a manic depressive in uh, Florida. They're taking them already. It's a send them one. the discount code. Send them the discount code, Sabrina15. Thank you. Exactly. <laughs> They're familiar, but get them the discount because they'll appreciate it. That's it. Beautiful. Yeah. Thank you. Wasn't that poetic? That was beautiful. That was seamless. 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 All right. Now we'll pretend like we didn't just do an ad read. What were we just talking about a minute ago? <laughs> I don't know, but it led in right Grief to Grief and virginity, etc. Yeah. yeah, something like that. It led into it perfectly. So on and so forth. And what, what have you? Oh, the bong. Yeah, Making the bong. bong Making the, the bong. Stuff. Making the bong and then everything. Choosing, cruising, cruising, the choosing, and the boozing. I'm boozing into the doozing. True. What are we at? 48? 52. Okay. Well. Cool. Pretty close. Okay. Well, it was an ad read. So, you know, <laughs> twist my nip and call me wrong. I'm <laughs> <laughs> um, just kidding. I would like that. Okay. Anyway, let's do plugs up our ass. I think I know we're going to get we we got monetized on YouTube and then, Ooh, and then we right. got unmonetized. <laughs> I don't no, think we get so. No, it's not unmonetized. It's that they they're not giving us the full. Right. Ad. Limited. Yeah, of right, course. Right. Limited. Limited. Yeah, yeah. Limited. I think Limited. this might get full, though. I don't yeah. think we said anything bad. No, this might no. Be full. I think we're good. I think this will be green. Yeah. 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 Yeah, no, it's good. Manifesting that. Oh yeah. my god, yeah. Well, manifesting just like I'm manifesting fucking my new neighbor because I fucked my old neighbor. Again. Okay. So it's great. Yeah. So, good. but we'll talk about that on the Patreon. Okay. That's fine. Cool. Sweet. Okay. You go first. Um. Okay. So plugs. Yeah. Follow me, funny girl with tits. Subscribe, like, do everything. Please rate our podcast on like Spotify and iTunes and all that because like I guess I never plug that. Oh yeah. I guess you have to plug that stuff. I mean, yeah. I give it a cats. rating. Give it a rating. Give it something nice. If you guys could like share this, this would rock. I mean, wow. Literally very excited to pass 1100 mm-hmm. and on to the next. Very nice. And oh, oh, and Max. Yeah, yeah. Just like that's perfect. What? I thought you were reaching for the merch that you're going. But no, he's going to text on his phone. Something's wrong. He's Something's checking up. the time. He's not checking the time. I'm sorry. The time off. Because you have a hard out, right? I have a soft out. I have a soft out. Yay! Cute. I'm sending them. I'm sending them to patrons. Yeah. And then also to for sale. And we're gonna do a bunch of stuff and I'm slamming them around. I have to give you the tattoo. Oh, that's so funny. I have to give you the tattoo. Not today, next time. I have okay. to go to a graduation party later. Well, I'm not putting it on you. I said I have to give it to you. Oh, yeah. Not like I thought one? on yes, an episode. That's one of them. Next no. episode you should put it on me on the episode. Do you want me to do that? Yeah. Okay. Right that's very coyote ugly of us. <laughs> yeah. It's like that fucking horror. Yeah, this is it. These are Perfect. the tattoos of me. That's so funny. They're and you're going to have one on yourself. Yeah, dude. Small Sabrina and big Sabrina. Don't talk to me or my son ever again. <laughs> <laughs> seven years and seven pounds. Here we go. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, oh, this is a great photo from 2016. Let's print them. <laughs> 
don't make new ones. It's so funny. It's really not that old. It is from right before the pandemic, but whatever. Yeah. Um. It, it just looks great. Whatever. You can buy them a you Pamela You still look Anderson. like that. I, I, you know, yeah. I just have my fucking endo and everything oh, like yeah. that. And yeah, I didn't. Whatever. I love the bikini app. I love that. Yeah. We're out here. We're out Subscribe. here. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Shows my Instagram, all that fun stuff. Um, Nat? Natalie DeChico edits on Instagram. D-E-C-I-C-C-O underscore edits. Watch Gas Digital now on the Gas Digital website. GasDigital.com. Use code now for a discount. Um, that's it. Patreon. Patreon.com slash funny girl with tits. Pick a tier today. And um, yeah, it's going to be fun. Cool. Max? Uh, no one Max. cares. <laughs> this is Max Love Marcus you, bye. Comedy. <laughs>